In the last session, we studied about trigonometry. In this session, we will study application of trigonometry. Before knowing what are the application of trigonometry, you should know the following terms. First, line of sight. Second, horizontal level. Third, angle of elevation. And fourth, angle of depression. Let's see what do you mean by line of sight. Consider a boy standing on a ground and a tower which is at a certain distance. That boy is watching the top of the tower. So that imaginary line is called as line of sight. Line drawn from the eye of the observer to the point in the object viewed by the observer is called line of sight. Let's see what do you mean by horizontal level. A boy is standing on a ground at a certain distance from a tower. That boy is watching exactly straight to a certain point on the tower. That imaginary line is called as horizontal level. So horizontal level is the line of sight when the person is looking at a point in an object. That line is called horizontal level. Horizontal level is always parallel to the ground. Now let's see what do you mean by angle of elevation. Consider boy standing on a ground who is at a certain distance from a tree. So this will be his horizontal level. That boy is watching the top of the tree. So that line will be line of sight. These two lines make a particular angle. That angle is called angle of elevation. So angle of elevation is the angle between the horizontal line from the observer and the line of sight of an object that is above the horizontal line. Now let's see what do you mean by angle of depression. Consider a building and on the top of a building a boy is standing. So this will be his horizontal level. A boy is looking at the base of the tree. So that particular imaginary line is called line of sight. These two lines make a particular angle and that angle is called angle of depression. So angle of depression is the angle between a horizontal line from the observer and the line of sight of an object that is below the horizontal line. If you like the video, please hit the like button. Do share it with your friends and post your comments. You can watch the entire syllabus of CBSC Math on our YouTube channel. Do subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to never miss an update. Thank you for watching.